Hey guys, good morning, guys. It's John. First of all, we're skipping past the shadows on my nose. Okay, it's literally my windows. Okay, because when I cover up my windows, it goes away. So, shush you Literally, ever since I got this cup, I cannot stop drinking out of it. It's actually an addiction now. Get some coffee this morning. Anyway. Oh my god, I need to talk to you about something. Also, this is a shame for medium because a lot of you ask. But basically, the amount of times people have tried to scam me is insane. Like, it's actually insane. Like, the amount of bloody emails I get literally a week of people saying, Oh, your TikTok account is getting hacked. Quickly log in to restore it. Do I look stupid to you? Like, I've also gotten them for my Snapchat. And, like, what the heck? Because... The reason I know it's so fake is because all of my emails that I have, like, public to you guys is my business email. None of my accounts are linked to that email. So it's like, what are you trying to do? What are you actually trying to do? Also, the other reason why I know it's so fake is because it appears in my spam. And I'm pretty sure that if it was actually getting hacked, I would get a different notification. It wouldn't go to my email, especially to my spam. It just gets me so angry because people think they're slick. They actually think they're slick. They think they know what they're doing. But no. I'm educated in this stuff. I know what I'm talking about. Because they ask for, like, my account PIN number. And, like, like I'm pretty sure TikTok and Snapchat have that stuff, okay? They don't need it to verify it's me. No, because the thing that annoys me is that people actually fall for it. And that they're actually, like, gaining stuff from it. It's like... Anyway, run over. Moving on. Okay, I close the blinds because the shadows on my face look ridiculous. Why can I kind of not be asked to get ready? My body's really close. I have a crack on my lip. Like, right here. It really hurt. We already started, so I might as well just finish my makeup. I kind of don't want to do blush, so we're not going to do Okay. This is literally my face step ever. Like, it completes the whole look. Perfect. Okay, I put on literally the tiniest amount of mascara because, quite frankly, can't be bothered. Okay, all finished. Bye, guys. Have a gorgeous day and make sure not to get scammed. Ready with me for school, except I'm extremely rushed. Um, even though I'm rushed, you know, still gotta make a video. Um, I have like under seven minutes to get ready because I took forever to crimp my hair because it's only my second time crimping it and I don't know why I did it and I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like as the days go on my cough is getting worse. I thought it was gonna get better but it's definitely getting worse and it's not just me that has like a cough like i gave my mom my cough and a bunch of other people in the group have all different like sicknesses which is really weird um i'm literally so starving so my motivation right now is food and the faster i get done the faster i can eat my makeup's been like weirdly um kind of rubbing off i don't know how to describe it throughout the day and i think it might be my primer so i'm trying my elf one for the day to see if it's the primer um i forgot to plug my chromebook in and it's probably gonna be dead for school okay we're gonna change up strategy today we're doing mascara last because it takes the longest to do and i feel like if i get the rest done then i can do mascara fast i forgot how much stickier this primer was and it's like kind of messing up my makeup but I don't have time for that. It was kind of nice being back at school for the first time after spring break yesterday. But it also kind of sucked. Because it's like, mm, this is my life for the next 11 weeks until summer. Okay, just in my mask. I'm just going to spray my face. <coughs> I just got makeup on my shirt. Okay, sitting OOTD, Hollister, Aeropostal, Nike socks, um, I don't know, these are from my mom, Sheen, my mom, some boutique, Sheen, actually no, these are both from Target, oh, probably should take my clips out. 
Okay, it will settle down throughout the day because this is what I thought last time. I was like, what the heck is happening? But that's it. Bye, guys. I love you. <laughs>
if you don't know, I'm, I'm getting more active on YouTube. But anyway, I'm vlogging this whole trip for YouTube on my camera. I don't want my skin to get really dry on the coach. We're going on a coach and then we're going on a ferry. But we was going to watch the Titanic. We was also going to watch 13, but they've taken off of Netflix. And we love 13. 13 is a shooting Sasha and I's movie. But I'm going to love a whole load of this Summer Friday's jet lag mask on face. Because I just know my skin is going to go really dry. I got my mum to put both of our hair. I asked her very nicely and she agreed very nicely. Because we've got all of our out... Ew, we've got all of our outfits off of Sheen. Well, not off of Sheen, we got the inspo off of Sheen, and then we like. I've got found... my outfits off of Sheen, everything's new. Yeah, you don't buy. Not Sheen, Pinterest, yeah. Sorry, I'm getting muddled up. So the outfit inspo was off of Pinterest, and we ordered literally all of it on Sheen because it's only gonna be one time wear. Why am I gonna spend a fortune? But I found really cute Pinterest pictures, so I'm fully copying all of them, which means head to toe, like hair to the shoes to the colour of my toenail. Me and Natasha are literally complete opposites. Like, this is her right now. This is her. She's very groggy and tired and moody. And I, my energy oh. is through the roof because I'm just at Layla. Okay, I'm almost all done. I'm just going to put some of this on my eyebrows. But also, make sure to go follow my Instagram because I think I'm going to be posting it on there the most out of, like, out of Instagram. No, way, out of YouTube and Snapchat. Sorry, I... Sorry. Pardon me. But I'm going to post on Instagram loads, so make sure to go check out Instagram. It's Layla Eleni K. Same as my TikTok. Her fingers are stuck. Exactly. I'm absolutely Stop terrified. Me. This is my first holiday alone, and I'm doing it with this complete weirdo. I'm so scared. Yeah. Like, and then my mum told me she did like like something insurance, like life insurance or something like that. I don't know. And I'm really scared because I've went. I've been to Disneyland before. I went in 2018, quite a few years back. It was with Disneyland. It was with PK again, but I barely remember that because I was so long. A guy. All I know is I wet myself on Tower of Terror and I'll probably end up doing it again. I love rides, but I just get so scared. Anyway, I'm all done. So I'll make sure to keep you all updated. I'm gonna get loads of TikToks, loads of Instagram pictures, loads of content for YouTube. Okay, bye bye. Hey guys, get ready with me to hang out with my friends. Happy first of the month, April Fool's. Time is actually going so quickly, but I'm really excited for today because yeah, me and my friends, and it's going to be fun. Um, the weather keeps changing because it keeps looking sunny outside, but then apparently it's meant to rain. So I'm just wearing this white fox hoodie, my Zara jacket, and leggings. The most basic girl outfit a basic girl could get, but I don't care because I love it. Also, we're going to ignore this. My hair's getting my outfit wet, but it's okay. It will dry soon. I'm going to use my Cordially Facial Spray for um, Hyaluronic Acid. Oh, that was a lot. Minty. Um, but yeah, I can't believe it's already Monday, like, the past few days have flown by. Also, if you haven't already, go see my YouTube video of my Top Fest Day 2 vlog. I posted it yesterday. And my next YouTube video will be on Wednesday. The, um, Sunday and Wednesday are my posting days. Past few, well no, the past, like, week, my schedule's been a bit on and off because, like, I posted things on a different day because, um, I forgot to post it and stuff, but... I'm going to be back to re reg regular schedule today. No, from now on. Yeah, so I'm. Sometimes the stutter gets too much. I just have to finish the sentence. Okay, I'm using my Glow SP Clump Clump Cream. But I'm meeting everyone at like half 11, 12, and it's actually 5 past 10. Like, I get ready too early, and I'm actually going to be so bored, but. Oh well. Guys, my. Frank Ocean and Scissor Obsession is getting a bit too much. I literally play them in every single get ready of me, but it's okay. I'm trying to fuck them. I'm gonna use my Indu brow gel. Okay, I just finished my brows and I'm actually gonna use my new El Calgary primer. I keep forgetting to actually use primer because my old one ran out and then, like, I just never use primer anymore, but I'm gonna use it today. Sorry, that, that was just the end of Ivy, guys. Um, oh my god, it is so weird, this being brand new. Like, I haven't had a brand new Elf Power Rip Primer in a very long time. Oh my god, it's not even coming out yet. Oh, there we go. Did in, uh, my brows are definitely going to mess up doing the rest of my makeup, but it's okay. Okay, I'm going to use my Rare Beauty bronzer. Um... I've been yapping for so long. How is it 2 minutes 30 seconds? I literally never know when to stop adding bronzer. Like, I probably added way too much. My forehead is a bit dark, but I just like being bronze. Can we taste? 
I haven't used my Made by Mitchell Sweet Cheeks in a while, so I'm gonna use it. I don't know what's gone all over it. I think a blush has filled. Oh no. This is becoming a tad bit chaotic because there's things everywhere. Okay, the makeup is actually makeuping today. The blush is a bit uneven, but my blush is always uneven, so that's no difference. Um, now it's lashes time. I'm just gonna curl them and then use my YSL mascara. Actually, I might use my Primark one. I haven't used this in a hot minute. Okay, now I'm shooting the Primark mascara. You can't see it on camera, it's literally white, but in real life, the sky is very blue and it looks sunny, so hooray. Okay, so the makeup is finished. I'm gonna use my Charlotte Tilbury setting spray. So hopefully this lasts. Okay, so this is my outfit for today, and I'm just gonna wear black air forces. Um, I'm gonna spray some Victoria's Secret velvet petals. And yeah, bye guys. I'll be tattoos and mask in the turn you. Why do I look so pale? Why do I look so pale? I literally tanned a couple days ago. I can't sing this song or I'll get banned. Guys, I'm supposed to be getting picked up in 10 minutes. Why do I not have any time management? I'm just sat downstairs watching freaking YouTube videos of that Duncan guy that like trolled... <laughs> that trolled Olivia Rodrigo fandom. I was cackling though, that was so funny. Why, is it, why did I say that so much? I was cackling though, that was so funny. <laughs> I've put too much on my forehead again. I'm, I'm literally predicting it. So I'm just going to take some off and I'm just going to put it on my chin. Uh, I'm gonna rub this in, hold on. I love the fact that I have so much more confidence when I do my bronzing drops. Like, I probably don't even look any like... I don't even look any more tanned, to be honest. But I feel more tanned. So that's all that matters, isn't it? Guys, is it just me? Or do these sponges look quite edible? I love this song so much. Why do I keep sticking my tongue out? Why do I do that? If my body was a boat, could you stare that sail? Mm, make you feel like it's a 1960s Hollywood trailer. Classic like cars, classic walk up as a book tailor. Just cause I could love you. The one fuck you're gonna make it all worth it, worth it, worth it. My hands are still a bit orange. Actually, they're very orange. Let's just ignore it. I know the concealer isn't blended out properly. Don't come for me. I've done that on purpose. I'm gonna do my contour and then I'll finish blending in my. There's a hair in it. Can you see that? Slay! I genuinely can't take myself seriously. The nose god <laughs> I look like I've got a wonky nose. <laughs> the power of nose contour is so crazy. How do I fix it now? I don't want a wonky nose. Quite as help. Right, I'll be I'll be. I fixed it guys. Thank you guys so much for all your edits. I genuinely love them all so much. I'm trying to get through to them all. But it's quite hard because there's so many. I'm not reposting all of them anymore because otherwise my reposting is literally just edits. So um, I'm only going to be reposting a few. But obviously I'll try and like and comment on lots of them. And like my favourite, 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 favourite ones I'll put on my story. And I'm less likely to put your edit on my story if you ask me to. So don't be in my DMs. Because the amount of people in my DMs like, Poppy, can you put your my edit on your story? Poppy, can you put my edit on your story? Like... 
It's kind of giving you only want me to do it for clout. Do you know what I mean? So obviously, obviously, I appreciate you making the edits. But if you ask me to put it on my story, I'm not going to. My head contour. Oh, just my whole contour today isn't giving. Guys, my contour today is not giving. Or just any of my makeup, to be honest. I don't like it. I don't like it. Guys, I'm going to use my blush today because I haven't used this in a bit. I've been using my Rare Beauty one a lot. So I'm just going to put that there. Slay. Guys, I think I put a bit too much on my nose. <laughs> I feel like Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. Right, I fixed it. Um, I feel like my makeup is not makeup in today. And I'm really just not here for it, honestly. Like, why is just nothing? What is that? Like, what is that? <laughs> Guys, I'm going to try and fix this monstrosity with some powder. Because I don't even know what this is, honestly. It's making me want to cry. I don't know what has happened. I'm just not here for it. Guys, I think I fixed it. I'm going to do some highlighter. I'm so sad my highlighter broke. Like, it's genuinely such, like, a sad thing. I don't know why, but just, yeah. Right, my um, my base is done, but I need to go brush my teeth so that I can do my lip liner. What is it in my hair? I don't know what happened there. Right, I'm going to go brush my teeth. I'll be right back. Right, guys, I'm back. Um, I'm going to put this lip liner on. Um, I'm just going to put some of this lip gloss on as well. So this is quite a long get ready of me, guys. Guys, Evie stole my eyelash curler. Also, Annie's here. <laughs> right, I'm just going to do my lashes um, and I'll BRB. I'm actually going to put some of this UK lash serum on underneath because my lashes are not great at the moment. Like, they just keep coming out. Guys, I've done my lashes, but they've gone a bit flat, so I'm going to wait for them to dry and I'm going to curl them again. But I'm just putting some heat protection in my hair. Because I'm going to um, straight, straighten my hair. Right, I'm going to put these earrings in. These gold hoops that I've been wearing for like the past like, four days. I hate wet sleeping in earrings, so it really gets on my nerves. So... <laughs> Right, guys, I'll fix my lashes. They're lashing today, I can't lie. Anyway, this is a really long get rid of me. I love you so much. Let me take my, let me get my clips out. I'm going to go straight in my hair quickly. But, yeah, I love you guys so much. Mwah. Thank you for 50k. Hey guys, get ready with me, except I'm in a rush. Okay, so basically, um, I decided to sleep in a bit today because I was really tired. I went to bed really late, which probably was not a wise decision because now I'm literally in a rush. And I'm also straightening my sweater because I'm the only one that straightens, like, my sweaters. Because it's so wrinkly and I feel like if I just go like this, it's basically an iron, you know? I don't know if I'm, like, crazy or if, like, I'm the only one who does this, but please let me know because... I feel like it's just logic, because, like, if you use an iron, you're basically doing the same thing. Okay, I've given up with trying to, like, make it not wrinkly, because I don't think it's gonna work. But I also don't have anything else to wear. Like, I swear, everything's dirty right now, so... Okay, um, anyways, let's just finish getting ready and just ignore the wrinkled sweater. Today's, like, only a half day anyways, so, like, I don't have to, like, look good. I feel like on half days, literally, like, nobody cares. 
anyways um, i'm just gonna skip like half the steps in my routine because like i don't have time so we're just gonna go straight to moisturizer because i don't have time to do anything else i feel like these um bronzing drops save me so much time because like i don't have to use contour if i use them i mean i probably still will but like whatever okay also i'm breaking out really bad right now but i think it's just because i started using this like actual acne like um treatment stuff the stuff that you get prescribed and i think it's just like my skin is like breaking out right now because it's like working if that makes sense i've heard though that, that happens to a lot of people where like their skin gets really bad while using it but then it like gets better after so i'm just hoping that's the case for me okay i have eight minutes to finish oh wait no seven minutes to finish getting ready so i have to hurry it up I need like good brush recommendations to blend contour because literally nothing blends my contour. It's so annoying. I posted like my get ready with me a few days ago and I actually don't even know if I posted it. But anyways, I was talking about like my food safe exam thing and it was supposed to be yesterday, but she moved it to Friday, which honestly I'm so happy about because I really needed that extra time to study. Okay, um, I have six minutes to finish getting ready. I think I can actually do it if I like keep going okay also if you guys have any recommendations for like good skin tints please let me know because i love my halo glow but i feel like it just makes me look greasy but like i need the extra coverage so please let me know but i don't like foundation because it feels so heavy especially at school but i also don't know like a good skin tint so please let me know oh my gosh you guys i really have to hurry up i feel like that's all i've been saying this entire video but you know it's fine okay honestly i don't have time today to have a good lash day so i'm just gonna do like that and that on both sides oh that's that's rough okay lashes are done now i just have to do my bottom lashes except i like doing this sky high because it like doesn't smudge because i love telescopic but on my bottom lashes it smudges so much but like my lashes end up looking so good so like it's kind of worth it oh my gosh guys i'm in a rush I don't know if I've said that yet, um, but now I'm just going to do my nose highlighter and my inner corner highlighter. Okay, I'm just going to do the tiniest bit of the brow gel. Like, I'm just going to brush my brows in place so they look somewhat better. Like, that's literally all I'm going to do. And now I'm just going to set my makeup. Oh, I look really stupid doing that. Anyways, oh my gosh, I forgot to take mascara off my eyelids. Guys, I cannot be showing up to school with mascara, like, all over my eyelids okay um i think that's it i have to leave in one minute okay guys i actually think i did pretty good on time i'm just gonna like brush my curls a tiny bit more i feel like they actually turned out like pretty good today and like i'm not scared to brush them out because like they only have to last for half the day because my school only is for half the day so okay my lip gloss is downstairs but yeah that's it bye guys one type of person that I could never be friends with is a positivity princess. But okay, let me like elaborate on that for you. Because I already know some dumbass bitch is going to be like, why are you saying it's a bad thing to be positive? Like I'm not. I'm saying it's a bad thing to be overly positive to the point where you literally have no personality besides that. Like that person that you'll be like, I feel so ugly today. Like I feel so gross. And they're like, don't say that negative talk about yourself. You are beautiful and you need to love yourself. Like, there's so many other ways you could say that same thing, like, differently. Like, no, be like, no, girl, you're hot. Shut the fuck up. I can't with that shit because it literally physically makes me feel like I'm walking on eggshells 24-7. I just can't handle it. Like, if you're venting about something or someone and they're like, you shouldn't say that. That's mean. Like, we need to be nice to everyone. Like, it's not like I'm holding the person at gunpoint, like, bullying them. I'm just trying to rant. Like, agree with me. Like... <laughs> In my personal opinion, I don't feel like talking to my friends should feel like talking to my fucking great aunt. 99% of the time, the people who are actively saying things like this are the same people that are literally doing the same shit, just not in front of you. Like, you're great for the economy, but I just don't see myself ever being close with someone <laughs> like that. There is actually nothing more fucking annoying when, like, you and your friends are having the most, like, vulgar, honest conversation. And someone in the room is just like, you guys shouldn't say things like that. Ooh. Just like a total fucking vibe killer. I feel like since becoming an influencer, my mind does this automatic thing where like I spin what I say around to see how people could like manipulate it and take it in an offensive way. I am not referring to like bullying innocent people or talking shit about like innocent people. I mean like treat others with the same respect that is given to you. And I stand by that in every aspect of life. I just don't understand why you feel the need to parent like the whole world. Why do I feel like someone in the comments is gonna be like, now you're coming for us for positivity. We can't have any anything like no just don't be fucking annoying and criticize people for things that you know damn well you do yourself i love you hobnockers and i'll see you in the next one